everyone, Matt here from Herbal House and in this video we are taking a closer look at the Four Seasons Aurora range. So the Auroras, they came to be because the original Helios design had so many requests to offer them in a single bar formation, which you can see we've got laid out before me. There are three different spectrum types, but before we get into the details I always like to start with the packaging and what you'd expect to see delivered. So in this particular case they've done a wonderful job with this Four Seasons Aurora box. Of course there is some fine foam packaging in there to keep the LED nice and safe and of course they have a full set of hangers and hanging wires to set that up but we'll cover that shortly. Now for our customers I always do mention that these boxes will come black wrapped and completely covered so this isn't what you're going to see turning up at your doorstep. Nice plain packaging for everyone. So now that we've covered the box let's get into the specifications of these three LEDs here. Now with the frame and layout of the actual panels themselves they measure a nice long 79 centimeters by 10 centimeters wide. So this has got a nice span and coverage for reach and a little bit of width in there to ensure enough saturation. The heat sink or the actual frame itself is a powder coated black aluminium design. So it's of course passively cooled, no fans or anything like that to cause any noise and will of course reject heat to ensure reliability. At the very ends of the frame we have a set of hanging hooks which you can of course use the included uh, equipment or you could jerry up something yourself no problem at all they do allow those options. The dimmers come on a 1.8 meter cable with a full manual control so you can just ramp that up and down nice and easily. The power cable itself is 1.8 meters long so you've got a bit of reach there to suit your power needs. Now the cables are connected via waterproof plugs so that's good for reliability and the driver itself is IP67 rated. So this entire panel is good to put up with very high and harsh conditions without any problems at all. Now we rate the approximate flowering coverage for this particular panel to be about 1.2 meters by about 0.6 in width. So that's obviously a very general coverage because a lot of people will find that they can either run the panel closer reducing that coverage or lift it a little higher to extend that coverage as is. Okay so you can see this is quite contrasting to the last light with that very cold white light. So we refer to that as 5000K which is a little bit higher up in the colour temperature range which means we're getting a very blue emphasised white light. So what that means for your plants is they're going to grow shorter and they're going to grow stockier which is why it is the only spectrum on this panel. Of course powered by Samsung LM301Bs at that particular spectrum. So for a lot of people they'll be using this in a much larger space than you would a flowering light. For instance we'd rate this coverage to be relatively comfortable for about 1.5 metres length coverage by around 60 to 90 in width coverage. For a lot of people you'll be running this at around 18 hours or longer and keeping in mind that you do have the to adjust the variables of intensity to suit your needs. So you could even use this as a propagation light if you absolutely had to. It is a wee bit intense but with the dimmer you can certainly make it suit your plant's needs and requirements. And last but certainly not least is the full spectrum unit. So this unit finds a happy balance between a veg and flowering specific unit with a combination of 3000K and 5000K CCT or colour temperature Samsung diodes with some Osram 660, 730 and UV diodes to help enhance flowering performance because most people they're going to use this panel from start to finish and they do need a little more emphasis on flowering which is why those have been included. Now in terms of actual coverage of this panel we find that it is certainly versatile as you can have it nice and close and have the same relative coverage as the flowering unit but again if you did need some higher up veg coverage no problem at all lift the unit nice and high and crank the dimmer up and you'll get the same results as the veg unit. So with that in mind the spectrum itself is of course designed to be an all-rounder with no exact emphasis on one or the other which makes these a really great choice for people who aren't too sure on what they need or what they're planning to do with their plants in that particular growth stage. Okay so we've strung up all three lights so you can see what they look like at least in this particular application. Now we have used all the included hanging equipment so that's the wire hanging clip which pop in at each end and the adjustable rope ratchet which really does make assembly or installation an absolute breeze in just about any grow space. So these lights of course are extremely versatile especially with all three spectrums to choose from and with the dimmer modules included you can adjust the intensity to suit just about any plant and its requirements. So with the three spectrums on offer and the full 150 watts dimmable power these lights are going to suit pretty much everyone's application whether it be supplemental or even dedicated lighting because you can stack them up side by side just like this and they are going to provide the results that you need from well at least what you'd expect from any LED grow light especially the Aurora series. So I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have any questions at all please feel free to get in touch with us here at Herbal House. Thanks for watching.